एस चांद प्रेजेंट्स एजुकेशनल वीडियो लेक्चर्स एस पर दी ए आई सी टी ई कारिकुलम डिफिकल्ट कॉन्सेप्ट मेड इजी स्टडी एनी वेयर एनी टाइम In part one of uh, algebra of matrices, we did uh, addition, multiplication, uh, multi uh, we did addition, subtraction, division by a scalar of a matrix. Now, in part two, we'll be covering uh, the very important algebra property of a matrix that is multiplication. Hello everyone, I am Dr. Seema Thakran. If you want to study this topic in detail, please refer to the book by S. Chand Publishing. The e-book link is given in the description box below. I have already told you that division is not possible in matrices. It means if you have, so uh, matrix multiplication, I'll start with, then I'll discuss uh, 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 division. So matrix multiplication. In addition, I told you order should be same, subtraction order should be same. Here it is totally different and how? I start with the example only. So let's take this matrix and let's take up this matrix. So this, of, this is of order 2 cross 2 or I should add one more row and I just add. So this is now of what order? 3 cross 2. So this is 3 cross 2 and now I am taking here uh, 1, 2, 3. So what order B I have taken as? So this is uh, 2 rows and three columns what is very very important if uh, I, I i even i cannot add these matrices now you can easily see the order is totally different i cannot even subtract these matrices but i can multiply why and how you can see this is number of column of the first matrix number of column of the first matrix this is number of rows but i am not bothering this number of rows this is number of rows of the second matrix and this is number of columns. I am just concerned about the number of columns of the first with the number of rows of the second. It means if two matrices you have, number of columns of the first is equal to the number of the row, uh, uh, second, you can multiply. Okay, so now how to do multiplication sign is this either we write a dot or we don't even write. So both are the same thing. If I am writing AB and I am doing matrices, it is completely fine. There is no problem. AB is understood that it is a matrix, matrix multiplication. So this is my matrix. How to multiply now? Understand carefully. So the multiplication will go like. Uh, I just fill up the uh, 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 and what will be the order after multiplication what will be the order that is important. So the order will be 3 this this is left and this is left. So it will be 3 cross 3. It will be 3 cross 3 how come because this is left number of rows and number of columns. So the order will be the uh, rest part this is should be equal to this if you are multiplying then the order will be this the rest uh, the number of rows and the number of columns now if it is 3 cross 3 it means the element first element will be a11 second will be a2 a12 first row second uh, column first row third column because three columns three rows second row first element second row second element second row third element we have already discussed in our very first lecture how we write elements of a matrix and Element uh, understanding we have, but now on the basis of this writing, how it will become easy now. First row, first column, how you will multiply first row of first matrix. Only the understanding is this first element is now uh, related to first matrix. The second element will relate to the second matrix. This mat means we'll take first row of the first matrix and first column of the second matrix. This is how we'll multiply. So this is first row. And this is my second uh, first uh, column. 
so how you how to multiply now a this i'll multiply with this element wise so 1 into 1 plus 2 into 3 this is how we multiply how i am multiplying first row first column as per the element I have written here, A11. So, first row, first column, second ka. So, first and uh, first row, 1, 2, and this is my column, 1, 3. So, 1 into 1 plus 2 into 3. So, I just write up the element. It will give me 1 into 1 and plus 6. So, 7 it will give me. Now, I will write A12. So, first row, first row of the first matrix, second column of the second matrix. So, 1, 2, 2, 4 element uh, wise you will be multiplying. So, 1 into 2 that is 2 plus 2 into 4 it means 2 plus 8 and that is 10. Now, the same way A1, 3. So, first 1, 2 and then second, uh, third column I'll, I have to take. So, 1 cross 1, 1 then 3 into 2 and it will give me 1 plus 6 that is 7. Now 2 1. So 2 1 means this time you will be bothering the second row and first column of the second matrix. So 3 into 1 3 plus 4 into 3 that is 12. So 3 plus 12 is 3 plus 12 is 15. Now this for, uh, uh, row will be fixed now because this is second 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 column will keep changing first second third so now i am writing a22 so it means second row of the first matrix second column of the second matrix so second row of the first is 3 4 and this is my second column so 3 into 2 plus 4 into 4 so 6 plus 16 that is 22 then now 3 plus 12 that is 15 so this is how we write the element and now I write the last row. How to write up? This is 3, 1 I am writing. So third row, first column. So 1 minus 1, 1, 3. So it will give me 1 minus 3. So that is minus 2. Then 2 minus uh, 4. It will give me minus 2. And 1 minus 3 that is minus 2. So you can clearly see this is how we multiply any matrix. This is one example. I just take up one more example to clear you how we multiply because this is not that easy topic. So let's take up another matrix. This time I'll consider row and column matrix. So what are row, row matrix means? It will have only row. And column matrix means it will have only column. If we are multiplying, it means what, what I told you to check. So, this has one row, three columns. This has three row, one column. So, condition is satisfying. You can see this is matching. So, you can multiply. A, B order will be what? A, B order will be one cross one. It means just a single element. One cross one means just a single element. It means you will have only A11 element. And how, do, how we write A11? I told you. This 1 stands for the first row and the second stands for the second uh, column. So, 1 first row, 1 sec first column of the second. So, multiply column uh, element wise. So, 1, 1 into 1, 1 and then minus 1 into 2 plus 3 into 0. So, it will become 0. This will give me minus 2 and plus 1. So, just minus 1. This is the matrix. 1 cross 1, cross one matrix and a simple matrix. This is how multiplication is. This is how we do multiplication. Now, I take up two identity matrices and I just, this is, this will be my last example for multiplication. So, 1, 0, 0, 1. You can see I have taken two So, both are identity matrices, uh, but only written in a different way. So, let's multiply and let's see what will be the result. So, AB, this is same. So, we can multiply. AB order will be 2 cross 2. 
it means a11 a12 a21 a22 so uh, how to multiply first row first column so zero first row second column 1 second row first column 1 second row first column 0 so two three examples we have done on matrix uh, matrix multiplication this is how we multiply we got to know how we write order or when we can multiply the two matrices so in part 2 we did matrix multiplication and we have understood now that on what conditions or what properties the uh, ma matrix should have when we are multiplying two matrices we have checked the order so the uh, number of row uh, columns of the first matrix should be equal to the number of rows of the second matrix on the basis of that we can multiply and we know how we write the order of the matrix when we are multiplying so if you want to study this topic in detail please refer to the book by s chand publishing the ebook link is given in the description box below if you like the video please do like share and subscribe s chand academy don't forget to press the bell icon for the future updates of the upcoming videos all rights reserved This video has been prepared for educational purposes only. No part of it may be reproduced or copied without the permission of the copyright holder.